Hello future Minecrafters, this is your tutorial video for how to get started on Minecraft. And I am going to be showing you the basics on how to get started in a brand new world. So I'll just create a new randomly generated world and we'll get started. Oh, landed in a snowy biome, but that's okay. I will show you how to start from here. The first thing you're going to want to do is locate some trees. And trees look like this. I really wish there were more trees around here. It's okay, though. We'll, we'll just get this one for now. And then we'll go exploring for a bit. Make sure you pick up the wood. You don't want it to drop off to the side or something like that. Never want to lose your wood. And that's that. So, yeah, it looks like there's some more trees in this direction. We'll head off this way. heard a zombie so I'm gonna want to make sure I don't get snuck up on but it's daytime so I should be okay and I'm just gonna set up a crafting bench now you do that is you put the wood that you collected inside your crafting window and then you just click this a bunch of times and now you have wooden planks then you click on them right click one in each of your crafting slots get the crafting table and now you have a 3x3 three three crafting table here and you can do this wooden plank on top of wooden plank and you get wood or you get sticks and then if you take those sticks put them like that you can now make a wooden pickaxe and how you should remember these recipes is it looks sort of like the object that you're crafting. Like, this is an axe. That's a wooden hoe. And that's a shovel. So, but just remember the pickaxe for now, because that's all you really need. And then what you want to do is find some stone. And I'm not really finding any around here. Don't really wander too far away from your campsite because that will only end, end in disaster. What the f Okay. A good way to find stone if you don't have any immediately around you is to just make a shovel with the remain with like that out of wood and then just dig a little quarry sort of thing little stone mine. And it will be down here. There we go. And the beauty of this is that you can actually make this into your house if you want. But I'm going to show you how to make an above ground house because they seem to be more popular. Just get a good amount of this. I usually try to get 20 because that's the amount that you need for all of your beginner tools and a furnace. So, yeah. Now let's head back up and we'll make a couple things. First off, Let's make a pickaxe, and then let's make an axe, and we'll go and gather some wood. See how much faster that goes with the axe, though? You never want to gather wood without an axe. It's just so... It's it's not, not fun. For some reason I'm lagging right now. I don't know. My computer just 
just can't handle these astounding graphics. And you're just gonna you get you pick these up because the when you break the leaves eventually, and the leaves break on their own, and they drop these. They're uh, saplings. Just like put them back in the ground somewhere, and you'll be able to get more trees later. They'll just grow eventually. It takes a couple days though, so have patience. Don't expect them to spring up in five minutes. A couple more really simple beginner tips that can be offered. Most people usually figure it out on their own, but since this is a big beginner guide, always dig those two out first and then jump on top of that and then you can get an extra one. So that's pretty uh pretty cool. I'm pretty O C D about getting all the trees, so I'll just do that and Okay. And in case you haven't figured it out yet, different tools are gonna be better at different things. So shovels dig through dirt, whereas pickaxes dig through stone. And this stone pickaxe is much faster than my wooden one would have been. So once you've done that, you can uh, find a decently flat area, or even just flatten an area out or that's already kind of flat. And then put your wood in there, get all your planks. build your house. I like to just start with a um, seven long and then go seven this way so that you have a five by five interior and then where's that my knife made at? Okay it's right there so I'll put my door put my door towards the things that I need. I don't want to have to walk around my house every time I want to go to my mine. This is another cool thing you can do. It's basically you just... Building like this is the fastest way to build walls because you don't have to do one level at a time and you don't have to jump down like you would if you were trying to build three high at a time. It's just the best way to build. Then you're going to want to break down your thing, wood crafting bench, put it somewhere in here. And this is a furnace. Later on it allows you to, um, to smelt like metal and stuff, ingots into, into bars, so you can get iron bars instead of iron ingots, and iron bars will actually be able to be used to make iron tools which are the second best tools in the game and I'm looking for something right now I can't remember oh yeah I was gonna try to find some sand but make a piece of glass that's one thing you can do is you make glass out of sand by smelting it usually gla gla or sand is found in desert biomes which will be pretty obvious I'm not in a desert biome right now obviously or around beaches and these all just look like they're gravel beaches or grass beaches so gravel is not sand this is gravel by the way and so let me just get back to my house and I'll show you a lot of times you won't be able to find coal your first night and coal is the thing that you use to coal is the thing you use to make um torches and torches keep you alive at night you don't want to not have torches because they're just very much useful so what you're gonna want to do is first off make some wooden planks seeing as how you can't always find it in the ground 
it's basically just black blotches on stone, so just look for that when you're digging around underground and you'll get coal. But if you can't ever if you can't find that, then you can just smelt some wood and it'll turn it into charcoal, which has all the same functionalities as coal. And another thing you'll want is a sword. And you make that with sticks as the handle and two cobblestone going up. You can also make a wooden sword, but it's considerably weaker. I would not recommend a wooden sword. And it looks like the sun is going down, so this video might actually be too long. I can't. And the very last thing you want for your house here is a door. Open that by clicking on it, and it keeps the monsters out. So you got your coal. Put your sticks down there, coal right there, and that's how you make torches. I like to just kind of do this. And then I wouldn't recommend venturing out your first night, but if you feel like having some combat, and you can just remember you lose all your items if you die. So, really not encouraging. But, yep, that's how you make your first house. Thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe, join the forums, whatever. Bye.